What's going on, Ramon? Who's out there? Some crazy American. Don't worry. Eva will deal with him. Papa. These people want to talk to you. Eva, I thought we agreed to shoot intruders on sight. You, how did you find me? It wasn't easy, senor. We thought you were dead. You were wrong. They've brought you something, Papa. Can it be? At last, la malediction. Well, Signor Marquez, looks like La Maledicio hangs in its right place again. Indeed. I have waited all my life for this. But... Something interesting? The painting. It is different. The face in the middle. The one with the symbol of the tabula veritatis on it? How do you know about the tabula? A priest told me. Said it was the devil's work. Pa! Priests! Full of lies, every one of them. Oh, really? Well, this priest said that the tabula was an instrument to raise the devil. Fool! Who would want to raise the devil? But you do want to find the tabula. Yes, because it is a Gnostic treasure. It is special, and my duty is to keep it safe. I was sure that Marquez still wasn't telling me the whole truth. And now? I shall decipher the painting and find the tabula. Before she died, my mother said that once the painting hung here again, its meaning would become clear, and the root to the tabula would be revealed. So, what's the answer? Where's the tabula? I don't know. The room has changed. Was there something different about the room back then? No. Yes. I don't know. You must help me. Well, how? I, I'm not a Gnostic. Senor, you must, because soon the Russian will be here. He knows about Castel del Sanz? I regret, senor, that in Paris I told his sidekick a little too much. Ah, well, I guess we'd better figure this out. And fast. I'll go and keep watch. Shoot on sight, remember. Well, Nico, what now? You try and work out just why the painting has to be in this room. I'll go and see if Eva knows anything. Whether he knew it or not, I was sure Marquez had the answers. It was a shield on which heraldic symbols had been painted. The scroll beneath the shield read Puicharda. The scroll below the shield read Girona. Ramon, gun in hand, was peering through the old window. It was a circular stained glass window. It was Marquez. He was studying La Maledizio. The bookcase held an assortment of ancient books. The scroll under the shield read El Pont de Suerte. The scroll below the shield read Tremp. The scroll beneath the shield read Figueres. The scroll under the shield read Olot. The scroll below the shield read Berga. It was a collection of what could only be described as stuff. There was a piece of stone on the ground. It looked like a discarded statue. The stone fireplace was old and dusty. It looked like it had lain undisturbed for decades. Carved into the fireplace was a young man holding an orb. The halo reminded me of the figure in the clouds in La Maledizio.
An old man with a beard was carved into the front of the fireplace. It was very like one of the figures in La Maledicio. La Maledicio, back in its rightful place. But what were the clues? The plinths looked like they could be rotated. The plinth. The painting held all the answers. The Tower of Saints had led us to the Castel. I wondered where the other clues would take us. There was a tower within the ring. Maybe it indicated... The priest appeared to have a... He was... Inside the ring was a castle gate. I had no idea what it signified. Within the ring, there were a number of houses. It was a village or a small town. Inside the ring was what looked like an affluent town. It was the figure of a priest, but with a dog's head. The figure was pointing. The figure of the young man was just like the one on the front of the fireplace. It couldn't be a coincidence. The youthful figure held a glowing blue orb in his hand. The bearded figure was similar to the one on the fireplace in the hall. I wondered if there was a connection. The orb in the old man's hand glowed with a green light. It was an ornate tree carved in bas-relief. It was an ornate... Senor, a word please? Of course. Okay, so... Just uh, not uh, with me. Ramon... Sure was a little light in the charm department. Senor Marquez? Mr. Stobart? If we're going to find the tabula... Yes? Then you will have to help. Of course. I mean, by being totally honest with us. When have I not been honest? Tell me about the painting. When I was a child, I would stand here for hours just staring at it. Who was the mysterious painter, El Serp, the serpent? And what did it mean, La Maledicio, the curse? I asked my father, but he just told me to be patient that one day I would know everything. Senor, can you decipher any of the painting? The Tower of Saints, of course. I knew it was a castell. And the saints themselves are Gnostic. You see the woman in red? The one you marked in the photo? She is Mary Magdalene. We revere her as Christ's greatest disciple. The rest, I don't know. The symbol on the face, it is obviously the tabula. But the elements around it, I don't know. When were you last here, Signor? Not since that day when my father was killed. So why did the painting bring us here? As I said, because only here in this room will its clues become clear. Why is the Tabula Veritatis so important to the Gnostics? It is an object of immense power. My ancestors kept it safe for hundreds of years. They brought it to Catalonia as exiles long ago. In any generation, only one Gnostic knows its exact location. 
My father, Xavier, was the last of these. He knew dark forces were gathering, but I was too young to learn the secret. So he commissioned La Malediction, embedding clues to the location of the tabula within the painting. But what is the tabula? What does it do? I do not know. I know only that in the wrong hands it would be catastrophic for mankind. What happened back in Paris? We thought you were dead. A man came to the apartment looking for Miss Collard. He mentioned a stolen painting owned by a Russian. Obviously, I informed him that I was the true owner. Obviously. Next thing I knew, this thug had me pinned to a chair and was threatening to shoot me. So I told him of the castel, and while he telephoned his boss, I hit him with a little china dog. Guess he didn't know you were the pugnacious type. So Eva is your daughter? She was a gift from God late in my life. One day she will find room for Gnosticism in her heart. I am sure of it. Why would a Dominican priest, Father Simeon, describe the Gnostics as evil? That order was founded specifically to fight heresy and to eradicate Gnosticism. Behind their backs, the Dominicans were nicknamed the Dominicanes, or Hounds of God. For years, these dogs hunted down and butchered my people. They called us heretics, but in truth, they sought to find and seize the tabula. Did I ever mention Trevor? The old cockroach in a matchbox trick, eh? Oh, you know it. It's nearly as old as ferret in the pants. Hmm, I'm getting out of touch. Take a look at this sketch. It is the face in La Maledicio. It was drawn by the man who restored the painting. Then he knew of the Tabula Veritatis. What other secrets did he uncover? I don't know, but he's dead now. Just as well. The fewer that know the secrets of La Maledicio, the better. Father Simeon, the Dominican priest, was carrying these papers when he was killed. So? You're not interested in him? I have no interest in priests or their papers, senor. So this is you with your mother and father? Indeed, taken in this very building many years ago. We must hurry up and figure this out.